are going through when you are experiencing it. And some of these are waking up multiple night, uh, multiple times uh, in the night, taking more than 30 minutes to sleep. I mean, you go to bed and then you spend more than 30 minutes to actually go to sleep. And even when you sleep and then you wake up the next day, you are feeling uneducated. Thank you so much for joining us. And I'd like to invite Dr. Yong Xiao Wong, PNG Medical Group Head Scientist. Ladies and gentlemen, it is time to unveil the product that we've all been waiting for. Let's begin the countdown. When you are uploading these photos, you can use hashtag Zequal Natural and you can also use hashtag Better Z, Better Me. Sunam Sahil and Dr. Bai, slightly for priority straight. Okay, forcefully put your baby to sleep because you badly wanted to take a nap. All right, the mom, the quintessential mom of the century. Yes. Okay, pretending to be sick to avoid a social gathering since you didn't sleep enough. Always good. <laughs> well, then I must say thank you so much for being here. <laughs> and thank you for not being guilty. He's a good baby, she says. Wow, that is fantastic. Okay, and finally, you took power naps between the shoots when you were having a sleep deficit. Yes, you have to. So tell me, how do you, how do you wake up after those power naps? You know, um, usually I... Unfortunately, but yes, always... Good. We appreciate your honesty. <laughs> Prioritize sleep over work. One second, is your boss in the room? It's okay. I would still say guilty. Guilty? <laughs> okay, okay, well, we have an honest man here. Stuck to using only PNG products. The sleep routine. We're going to have a quick conversation about that. And I'd like to begin with Dr. Vijay. Uh, Dr. Vijay, can you take us through what is occasional sleeplessness and what are the reasons for it? So I think the COVID pandemic situation in this country has really um, sort of give us a glimpse and also amplify how you know altered the, the sleep schedule of Indians are really. So I think very two important point to take note that you know we are going into like you know hybrid uh, work model and as well as you know digital media connectivity. These have really give rise right to the sleeping rules, right? Not just on our um, physical health, but also mentally. Okay? So occasional sleep nights uh, in the month that you feel that you have difficulty you know falling asleep and you know, wake up multiple times at night, and more importantly, you wake up, you know, reflect that on the recent survey that we did for the ZQ National um, Survey. So 40% of the respondent, in fact, uh, claim that they sleep less than the optimal seven hours during a weekday, okay? And uh, a staggering 90% of them impact the next day. Now, that really translates that, you know, what Shahu has shared just now, right? 60% of the respondents feel that, you know, they are feeling very sleepy in uh, daily activities. So, 
I got one more figure over here, right, that actually over 30%, right, they will do nothing about it, right, thinking that, you know, sleep will improve over time. Okay, so one important thing to highlight that, you know, occasional sleeplessness can be due to like temporary, you know, job stress, uh, like uh, just before sleep, right, so all this, right, will actually impact on our, our sleeping patterns. But, right, they will go away, right, with a uh, good, you know, um, regime in sleeping habits and, and, and uh, schedule, okay. So, usually, um, you know, when I'm jet lag quite often because I fly so much. Obviously, being a mom, you know, we get all odds are all odd hours of the night, and um, and during the day also, you you have to catch a nap. They always say sleep when your baby sleeps. I'm like that's not easy. <laughs> that's like at all different different times, right? Because they don't have their own circadian rhythm yet. Uh, it only gets established much later. Um, so, you know, you're, you're sleep deprived for the first couple of months uh, of being a mom and obviously in films, you're shooting in the night as well and you're shooting 12 hour shifts in the night um, and then it's basically like jet lag, you wake up and then you have a turnaround day where you're supposed to get your uh, timing back yes. and that is very hard and, you know, some a product like this, like Zequel uh, Natura will be actually very, very you know, easy for me to use because how of safe, safe it is for me to use and yeah. as a supplement Need so not. that I can fall asleep. Yeah, fantastic. Oh, well, you always I've used it abroad oh, and uh, I'm very, very happy it's come into India. It's actually Good. a great product. Yeah. And we share your enthusiasm on that. You know, I also want to ask you that every actor in uh, B-Town has their own nighttime routine when it comes to listening to, you know, soothing music or applying creams and lotions. Can you spill the beans on your bedtime routine? What do you do just before you go to bed? It's going to sound very like new agey, artsy, <laughs> but um, so I basically do a little bit of a yoga routine where I do a little bit of meditation and deep breathing. Um, there, this is all before I had a baby, by the way. Now I just get the sleep that I can get. <laughs> But uh, so I do that. I hope I can get back to that. I use lavender essential oils and I rub it in certain. I have a hot bath first and do lavender essential oils. And I might have like a soothing natural tea, like a chamomile tea or something. And um, I switch off all blue light, is really bad for you. Yes. So all my phones, my laptops, my iPad, everything is outside like in another room, it's charging either in the living room or it's charging in my kitchen um, and then, uh, you know, I and now I'm going to take the sequel and Shura and yes. go to sleep. <laughs> um, you know, obviously brush your teeth after. Um, I, I don't know, how long does it take to act? Uh, so, uh, studies have shown that, you know, okay. if you think, um, like, it takes, you know, maybe like four to like maybe 15 minutes faster for you to take. So uh, I can brush my teeth. Yeah, <laughs> that much time. <laughs> enough time. Two minutes. Yeah, the dentist recommend. Yeah. All right. Thank you so much, Sonam. Uh, Sam, I want to ask you. I'm curious. What was the objective behind the launch of Big uh, Simple Natura in India? In our country? Yeah. I mean, as I was sharing earlier as well, as a pioneer of consumer health. Uh, it's always our endeavor to find the unmet consumer needs and uh, bring in the products that meet those consumer needs. Now, if they can, it's a supplement, right? It's uh, it's an easy supplement. Like uh, the doctor said, that it's it's naturally occurring in your body. Yes. Um, and you know, uh, it's 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 great. I'm looking forward to using it myself. All right, Doctor Vijay. Fast. Maybe I could just give an analogy, yeah. right? Our body also produces natural, you know, uh, body vitamins. Like, so these vitamins and minerals are really support our body functions, like bones development, like immune system, maintaining hair, skin, nails, right? So, so following the same route, right, of a supplementation, melatonin is supplementing your body's uh, melatonin when you need it. Try, uh, to manage uh, occasional sicknesses, so to say. Yeah. Yeah. Fantastic. Sal, uh, you know, I think you said it earlier as well. People in our country don't regard sleeplessness as a problem. Yeah. So, how do you aim to bring about a change in the mindset of people as far as. Yeah. So, you're absolutely right. As clearly data shows, 
15% of Indians are getting good sleep. They are satisfied with good sleep. That clearly means if majority of them are not getting good sleep, there is a lot of work that needs to be done in creating the awareness about the sleep survey that we just did and uh, this event. And our intent is really to do three things as I was sharing earlier as well. Through these activities, one, we want to bring the awareness so that people start talking about it and they are aware of that this is you know, very common problem or common situation among, uh, among people. And uh, second, we want to equip them with the right products, uh, which is equal natural. And lastly, but you know, uh, we also want to get people to share their experiences with others on how really melatonin helps them in getting the good night's sleep. Uh, so that really is another objective. So as Sonam was sharing earlier, that she has used the product uh, abroad, not here, but now she will be having the opportunity to use it here. Uh, through these experiences, others will get to know how melatonin and Zikul Natura can help them to get good sleep and hopefully people will start acting on it and uh, you know, we'll be able to tackle this problem yeah. one Indian at a time. Um, uh, something that I read um, was also that you guys have uh, vitamin D in it that makes you wake up fresher yes. and give you energy which I think yeah. is so great because everybody is afraid of taking a sleep supplement that might make you drowsy yeah. when you wake up and yeah. you can wake up easier and fresher and brighter and I love that about Zequil Natura. Yeah. You know the fact that you know you wake up with energy is amazing. Yeah. Yes. No, in fact uh, that's absolutely right or formulated for Indian consumers right. uh, and that is how it is uh, you know different uh, uh, product as well. And can you tell us who is the target audience for this category? Yeah so I mean, when it, when it comes to target audience, yes, I think all of us here, uh, because most of us uh, do experience uh, occasional sleep business. And I was, as I was sharing earlier, adults 25 to 55, uh, people with you know high stress jobs, uh, and we are the ones who are actually experiencing occasional sleep business. Yes. And at the same time, we are the ones who are probably not aware about the situation as well. Correct. So definitely, that's the target consumer for us. Okay, and finally, I'm very curious to know. Uh, so as I was saying, it is world's number one sleep aid brand. And uh, it has done very well in the markets like uh, US, in Europe, and uh, closer home in Asia. It has been launched in uh, Philippines earlier, and it has done really well there as well. Fantastic. Okay, so now we're going to move this conversation to the other side of the stage. Uh, I think this would be a fitting point for me to throw the floor. And the next day, your body does feel, you know, just it's slightly weird. It's not that it's a big side effect, but slightly weird. Do, uh, would this also bring on any kind of side effects? Yeah, I would refer it to yeah, maybe I can, Yeah, maybe I can take this question. So, um, as I mentioned, the melatonin gummy um, um, Zico have been sold many years over many markets, and we have very good surveillance um, monitoring. So there isn't any you know, uh, side effects uh, pertaining you know, in the case whereby if you take melatonin and you do not go to sleep, right, there are some you know, mild effects that saying people are having headaches and, and drowsiness, right, but that can be gone right, if you go to sleep after taking uh, melatonin uh, gummies. So yeah, that's, that's uh, what we have actually gathered so far. Um, yeah. And uh, finally, uh, so <laughs> Sona. First of all, it's lovely to see you after quite some time. Oh, thank you so much. It's so nice to meet you. Look, looking uh, uh, killer fashion diva as always. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> thank you so much. That's I, so sweet. I have you, uh, I mean, considering your schedules, probably it's the most erratic schedules. We in the media and y'all in the industry. 100%. Our schedules are too erratic. We, we, don't, we don't have a schedule. We don't have a schedule. Yes. And especially if you're a mom and you're working, Fortunately, I wasn't in the first two, three months, even though I started, I started work now, but I wasn't in the initially the first two, three months, but yes, my, since I was 17, my schedule has been erratic. So, uh, you're, if suppose you want to probably take up in your trailer van, would you uh, go for this? Well, I have to ask Dr. Yaji if it's okay for me to take it, because I haven't, I've always taken melatonin in the night before sleeping. During the day, is it alright for me to take and to sleep for two hours? Yeah, so it's not recommended, right, if you take short naps, right? So melatonin, um, once you take melatonin, like I've mentioned, 
the body will actually clear it naturally and it's actually intended for you to have a optimal sleep, quality sleep. And then the definition for quality sleep is, you know, about seven hours. So the recommendation to you is that take it at night, follow the natural you know, melatonin <coughs> cycle <coughs> and allow, you know, six to seven if hours. If whatever little yeah. bit I know, I don't know very much, as a supplement, uh, melatonin is only produced, if I'm not mistaken, in the night in your body, right? Not yes. during the day. Yes. Yeah, it increases in the night. Yeah. So if I take it in the day, I will ruin my circadian rhythm. Unless I have to switch my day and night if I'm shooting. Like if I'm shooting in the night and I need to sleep in the day, it's I black out my room and then I take a melatonin so I can switch my circadian rhythm. That's the only way I will take it. I mean, this is just me practically thinking about it. Yeah. Um, yeah. Absolutely. You know, especially when you're younger, right? You feel like you can work all night and then you can work all day and then you end up doing things and saying things that, you know, because you're tired, your brain isn't functioning right. And it doesn't matter what, you know, so yeah, I've said all the wrong things and I've gotten into a lot of trouble. And, um, you know, so yeah, I have. I'm, I'm sure you will go back and you'll remember some things that I've said. Uh, but yeah, so much and you know, I'm, I'm clumsy, um, uh, very clumsy and I remember I was shooting um, nights uh, for um, um, a Prem Ratan and Payo and I had to wear this like lovely sari and you know, and usually I'm like very particular, I like to tie my own sari, like I'm very like particular about how I wear it. And I had not, and I had to, and fortunately I had a slip and everything and I tied it correctly. It was a, I was a disaster because I, for some reason, could not, like, tie my sari correctly in the night. It just, it was just not happening, you know, and it was like that French chiffon which is constantly slipping from your hands. So, yeah, that's the only time I remember when I was fun, uh, like, like, going mad because of the night shoot. Uh, and Dr. In the human physiology, the peak of melatonin production in baby is the highest yeah. and gradually will decrease. Actually by the age after the nursing woman and, and getting pregnant woman, right, um, it is advised to talk to your doctor right, uh, before taking uh, melatonin or, or supplement because I think that's the, also the advice. We have as part of uh, FSSM mm -hmm. in India and we have uh, part of the license uh, for that of course uh, mm -hmm. and in the US of course we follow the US regulatory Okay, you know, I think we have many, many interesting questions that are coming up, but we can definitely, uh, you know, close this formal conversation here because the rest of the evening is available for conversations. Our spokespersons are going to be around. But uh, I think on that note, can we have a huge round of applause for sleep? For sleep, everybody. Yes, and for seeing Bo Natra, and thank you. Thank you so much for having this conversation. And uh, I would say a very honest one that, that really makes a huge difference. And <laughs> But of course, I've learned so much uh, about sleep today. All right then. Why not we all arise? I'm going to request the Zequel Natural team to please join us here on stage quickly for a photo opportunity. All right, everybody, give us your best smiles. This camera? Yeah. Close this camera. Huh? This camera. Thank you. 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 Thank So now on behalf of all of us, thank you so much for joining us. It was an absolute pleasure to have you here. Dr. Wong and Sahil, thank you so much as well. Thank you. Have a great evening. And to all of our guests, our friends from the media, thank you so much for joining us.